see you later. Was the camera plugged in? Hey guys, it's Jonathan from Bullet Motorsports. Today I'm going to show you a beautiful 2021 Ford Bronco. It's the first edition of Sasquatch. It has a four and a half inch lift, uh, custom wheels, 37 inch tires, and it's fully loaded. If you want to find out more information, click on the link below. That'll give you everything you want to know in regards to if we're going to finance it, if we're going to auction it off, or if we're going to give it away for free. Click on the link below. So this is purchased brand new from the dealership. It has 1,450 miles on it. It is fully loaded. It's a Sasquatch edition, as I said before. You can see the 37 inch tires right there. They're Mickey Thompson's and it's rolling on a set of grid wheels that are bronze or gold. It does have aftermarket exhaust. It has rock slide steps. So what that means is because of the height of it, you can open up the door and the steps oh, come go out. Oh, go figure, look at that. Would y'all look at that? Interior is perfect. It has a huge touchscreen, 2.7 liter twin turbo EcoBoost, made it to a 10 speed transmission. And the color? It's cyber orange. It's cyber orange, which when you see it in the light, it has a whole bunch of pearl in, pearl in it. And then when you put it, like we store it inside, indoors, it just looks like a mustard yellow. But outside, it's unbelievable. You've got your first edition Sasquatch emblem right here. It's just a sticker kit that they have. And then it'll have the sticker on the, on the hood as well. Black mirrors, big fender flares, rock sliders. And the interior for the Sasquatch, I believe has that blue throughout. Doors are easy to remove. So there's a little latch here and you can pull off the doors, power seats, and everything is LED, big 10 inch, touch screen. So now we have 1,508 miles on it. I drove it for the past two, basically two weeks. And it's, it actually drives really nice. It, it's not floaty. It feels tight when you're going on the highway. It's a good truck. Interior is very nice. You do have the ability to adjust your seats back. So there is a lot of comfort there. Baby seats fit in it. So uh, you put the baby in there, no problems at all. There's a lot of cool features for this one where you're gonna have the model designations for the Bronco. It's on the glass, I believe, too. Rear is very nice and easy to open. Uh, it does have a aftermarket mount for this. I believe it's a rigid mount with the LED strip for your brakes and the backup camera, which has modified the center cap for it to work. Here's the original mount. So if you guys wanna have that, I just didn't like that. Uh, there's your soft top mats, the original mats as well, and you can open up the glass. This looks amazing with the top off, but I don't want to do that. I've never taken it off. I want to keep it sealed as if it's never been opened. There's no dents or dings on this one. You can see that the paint is flawless. It's never been off-road. Maybe we'll go off-road today, I don't know. Just a nice truck. Sounds great too. So you can click on your lock button, double click that. Has a, I believe a Flowmaster. Flowmaster Flow FX and it sounds good. It's a little bit rowdy when you get on it. Nice black tips. You can see all that suspension under there. And I believe it was, I think it's a four inch lift or four and a half inch. I, hopefully I'm not getting that wrong, but it's, it, it's able to fit 37s with no rubbing and they don't stick out too much. It's like the perfect look when you go from the side.
Passenger side's really comfortable. You have grab handles throughout, so if you do take it off-road, you have the ability to hold on. Um, you can disable your sway bar. You can just turn one wheel if you need to as well. It has every feature. You have all of your toggles for auxiliary lights, so if you want to load this thing up with LEDs, you can. Your top comes off easy. It's a very simple task. These are the only pieces that we've actually taken off um, just to open it up. Your touch screen is really neat, and when you start it up, it has a, a Bronco going through. You can touch the button and it should do it. So you've got, normally there's a screen of the Bronco running through a field with rocks and all that. You do have climate control, um, heated and cooled seats. Actually, I don't know if they have uh, cooled seats, just heated seats. So you have heated seats and then you have your GOAT mode. So you can control your four wheel drive all at the push of a button and you can adjust your modes as you go through them. You have lockers front and rear. It's cool. Let's jump in and go for a ride. Let me show you under the hood real quick before we take it for a spin. Doesn't look like the old school Bronco anymore, huh? So you have a 2.7 liter twin turbo V6. All the electronics are very easily accessible here. You can see the little Garrett turbos with the Fomoco badging on each side. And then there's your rigid box for your steps, I believe. <laughs> Let's jump in and go for a ride. We're inside right now. You can see that we do have a, I believe it's a 10 inch screen right here. Then you have all your displays. You can go through your modes and select how you want to have it set up. Economy, slippery, mud, ruts, and it's going to go into four high when it does that. Um, sand, Baja, and rock crawling. Really neat. Horn sounds good. Sounds like a Ford Mustang horn. Shifter is very nice, and you, you can actually shift through the gears manually, so you can um, select the gear when you're driving it. You can see what features are on right now, so you have just rear wheel drive. Speedometer goes to 120 miles an hour. Stereo sounds great in it too. Stereo sounds great. That's all you get, probably get demonetized. Top is easy to work with. Uh, interior seats are great. You have a lot of storage space. There's a lock for your wheels and all your windows go up and down easily. They're all power assist. Bang Olufsen stereo. Let's go for a test drive. What we're gonna do right now is take it for a test drive, taking the sweeping corner here. We're going about 40 miles an hour. There's not a lot of body roll, which you would expect for a truck that's lifted up and it's pretty, it's actually not that narrow. So everybody goes, oh, the Bronco's narrow. This is not that bad. It's very comfortable. We're gonna turn left here. It is still peppy with 37s on it. You can hear the turbos. Feels good, going over some bumps right now. Not a bad ride. If you guys have any questions about this one, give us a call at 954-363-2261. We ship worldwide. I don't know if we can ship this one worldwide, but we can for all most of our inventory. So click on the link below, that'll help you out. We. It's actually pretty fast. Hope you guys are enjoying this test drive. We're gonna go get some outside shots for you. If you have any questions, give us a call, 954-363-2261. I love this thing, it drives great. Any features that you like, Will? Oh, I like the, the spotlights. How do you work them? You go here. These gives you all like front, rear, all your information, and then they have zone lighting and then you can select your zone you gotta turn on oh that's pretty cool no way oh See, would you look at that very cool well thank you for that feature review oh look at that <laughs> no wonder it took you three hours to take pictures of this thing 
know every single thing about it. I was trying to figure it out. <laughs> you need spotlights for daytime shooting? Well, I mean, I want to cover all the options. Got it, got it. For when you write the review, write the... Yeah, the description. The descriptions, got it. This one's going to be an essay. This thing is awesome. I think I've only said this thing's cool, this thing's awesome. That's the 60, feels good. The shift's quick too, they're, they're firm shifts. I'll let the next owner take it off-road, I guess. 954-363-2261, have a great day.